Hi angels, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I'm gonna be doing a Michael Kors video, but there's several things that I wanna talk about with this Michael Kors video. I wanna talk about the Michael Kors Cindy bag. I recently, a while ago, did a video on a Michael Kors Cindy bag, and I told you girls there was another color that I wanted to pick it up in. So I finally got a hold of my bag, you guys. I finally scored and got a hold of my bag. Remember, hit like if you enjoyed this video. Just hit like right now, you guys. Hit like and subscribe. Let's get started. Let's jump right in. So I have several things that I wanted to talk to you girls about with this bag. We might be here for a little minute. I'll try not to keep you guys too long. It's beautiful today in the Midwest. So enjoy some of the sun. I love weather like this. The other day it was kind of dreary, but today it's a beautiful day in the Midwest, you guys. So I wanted to talk about some of these Michael Kors bags. Without any further ado, Let's get the bag on the screen. <laughs> so here she is, my lovely Cindy bag. This is the one I wanted, you guys. So I did recently pick up this lovely bag in the lovely fuchsia color. It's the Michael Kors Cindy bag. It's the large dome Cindy bag. But the one I picked up originally had the fuchsia color, which is beautiful. I'm not taking anything away from that particular bag. However, when I picked up the pink one, I knew I wanted pink. I love pink, every girl loves pink. And at the time I was kind of torn in the controversy between should I get the pink, should I get the, this green color? And although I loved this green color, I was like, hmm, the pink might be gone because more women like pink. You know, I won't be able to find that one again. And so I did, I purchased the fuchsia, which I do love. I'm not gonna say, you know, I don't love it. I do love that bag. However, once I bought my lovely fuchsia bag home, I ended up yearning for this color. This green color is called cyan. It's spelled with a C and it's so beautiful, to me at least, it's so beautiful. It's not emerald, it's not, I know I have another bag in the peacock color green. However, this particular bag right here is in the lovely color cyan. And I just fell in love with this color. So I really wanted it. However, you girls know how that goes. Once you leave a bag, it's hard sometimes getting lucky and striking rich and finding that bag on the shelf again. So sometimes you have to go ahead and query online and go on the secondary market. And I didn't wanna do that. So I went hunting all around the city, all around Illinois, uh, the state, <laughs> trying to find this bag. And I ended up locating it again at another TJ Maxx. And when I walked in and I saw that this bag right here hanging on one of the racks, I was just like, I couldn't believe it. I was like, I found my bag. That was the one I wanted. So I couldn't, you know, I didn't want to miss out on a second chance. I had to pick her up that time. So now I'm happy that I have both the pink, the fuchsia color, in the Cindy Large Dome, as well as this beautiful cyan green. Now, the last time I showed you girls this bag, I didn't have a picture online. I couldn't find a picture of this green cyan color online. So I just talked about it and how it broke my heart. <laughs> and I pictured a bag that was in another color shade of green, or it looked yellow, but it was, I was calling it green, just to give you an idea of what I was talking about, because I couldn't find or locate a picture of this exact mwah, color cyan. Ah. <laughs> but now I have the bag in front of me. So you see the bag, the color that I was yearning for. What I love about the Cindy bags is the fact that they do the zipper tape, the same color as the bag so it's so so pretty with the cindy bags that they do that so i have a couple of accessories that i picked up to go with this bag and i just wanted to show you how that would look and how i would match it up and of course i did bring in my lovely fuchsia bag to show you ladies so i will be pulling that bag out as well so we could talk about it so one of the first things that i did i wanted some accessories to go with this particular bag so i went ahead and i picked up this right here this little wristlet and i believe i picked this up at ross this wristlet i don't know the name of it the name of it might be on the card in here let me see if i can find it what they're calling it so they are calling it jet set charm wristlet in brown so they're calling this wristlet the Jet Set Charm Wristlet in brown with the brown strap right here. I went ahead and I picked this wristlet up to match my bag. And then I got home, you girls, and I totally forgot that 
I have a similar wristlet to this when I purchased my Trista tote, but that's okay. So this is the wristlet that came with my Trista tote. And it's basically the same exact wristlet, just slightly larger. So it's okay. So I can use both of them now with this bag. I'll be able to use both of them with the Cindy Dome satchel with my large Cindy Dome satchel. However, this was the one that came with my Trista tote and I do have my Trista tote right here. So this larger wristlet came with my Trista tote. Okay, you girls, so I am back and you can see this is the lovely large wristlet that came with my Trista tote. And I totally forgot that I had this large wristlet. So I ended up picking up this smaller one and it's okay because I'll be able to use both of these wristlets either in my jet set, either in my Trista tote or in my large dome Cindy satchel. So I'm happy to have both of these wristlets, these Michael Kors wristlets. My Trista tote, right now, I just have it storing a few other items. I use this bag so much for work. I have a couple of stuff in here that instead of stuffing it with paper, I just went ahead and stuffed a few larger makeup cosmetic cases in there just so that it, my Trista tote would hold its shape. But I love using this as a work bag. When I moved into this bag and used it for work, I wore the heck out of it. I wore the heck out of this bag when I used it for work, and this is the Michael Kors Trista tote. I haven't pulled it for, for a while and used it at work. I may move into it again and start using it again as a work bag. Right now, I'm using a Karl Lagerfeld bag as my work tote, but I just love using the totes for work. So yeah, I just wanted to talk about how I totally forgot that I had that larger pouch to go with the satchel, so it's okay. The next thing that I wanted to talk about is I picked up a few green SLGs to go with my dome satchel right here. And this is just an Anne Klein card holder. I picked this up at TJ Maxx for like $9.99. And it's so cute in the green color. I thought this green color would look so nice. Okay, so on camera, it doesn't look like it matches the exact same color. But trust me, off camera, on camera, everything turns up so bright and so vivid that you see the colors and, you know, it's going to look like it doesn't match. But when I'm looking at it, you know, it looks fine. It's a close match. It's close enough to me. You know, it's close enough of, of a match to me. I thought I had my scissors in here. So I'm going to go ahead and enjoy this little wristlet with my Cindy satchel. And like I said, it is a Anne Klein wristlet. So I'm going to start using some of these accessories with my lovely bag right here. So yeah, I think that's going to look cute together. And then I do have, I did bring in another SLG that I thought would look good with it. And if this one didn't match perfectly, I know this one probably won't, but that's okay. Everything doesn't have to match exactly, exactly perfectly. It's my Patricia Nash card holder. And I just thought, you know, I want shades of green. I want shades of green to match the bag. So it's okay if they don't match perfectly. I just think that it'll look pretty if I just kind of, you know, have similar color green items to go with the lovely cyan, you guys. So yeah, these are the colors that I thought would look really, really pretty with that. I think when I wear her, I'm gonna use some of these accessories. And I think that's gonna look so, so pretty. Next, of course, I have to have in brown to match. Um, I'm just gonna bring my Ray-Ban sunglasses with me and the browns in the case, I think will look good inside my lovely bag as well as I just have my regular Louis Vuitton six ring key holder, even though it's not Michael Kors. I think that'll look cute because it'll go with the browns in my SLGs and the other accessories that I'm carrying in this lovely bag. So yeah, let's go ahead and take a look at the interior. So here is her lovely strap in the beautiful cyan color. And I just think that color is just so beautiful. I keep saying that over and over again because I just love this color. I wanted this bag so bad, you guys. I hunted and searched for it. This is what the interior of the bag looks like. 
and it is trimmed along the pocket with the beautiful green cyan color and then the interior is just you know the michael kors lining that says michael kors in signature print so i have some of my accessories in the bag now you girls and i don't know if you're going to be able to see what that's looking like i may take a picture and show you but that's how my accessories look stacked inside my bag So this is my lovely bags, you girls. So the next thing I wanted to talk about really, really quickly is bring my other beautiful Michael Kors Cindy on camera, the beautiful fuchsia color. So here she is, you guys. Here is the beautiful fuchsia color. And I am enjoying wearing this bag. I have to admit that I am enjoying the fuchsia as well. I've used the fuchsia so many times to work already. And the fuchsia is a gorgeous bag and a gorgeous color. I guess I just kind of felt like I might be missing out if I didn't get it in the lovely green as well. I just wanted to make sure that I added both of these lovely bags to my collection. And this is what the interior of the fuchsia one looks like. They're the exact same on the interior. That's the interior of the fuchsia one right there. And this is what the bottom of the fuchsia one looks like. They're exactly, like I said, identical. So you can see they are the exact same on the bottom. The only difference is the color in the handles. Both beautiful bags. I love the fuchsia one with the fuchsia pink color of the zipper tape as well as the green one. That just looks so beautiful. So I'm enjoying rotating these two bags, you guys. And even though these aren't totes and I usually use totes as my work bags, I'm enjoying carrying this style of bag to work also. You could always use a large dome satchel to work as well because it holds so much. And then these bags have that interior pocket along the back wall that's very useful because like the uh, zip zip totes and I'll come on camera with these bags as well and compare them to my zip zip totes but my zip zip totes don't have this extra pocket in the back here that goes the full length of the bag you know Michael Kors went ahead and put that extra pocket and the extra pocket in the back has a snap stud closure so that's good for putting your keys and having easy access to get in and out of the bag when you want to you know if you're in line at a store or somewhere so i just wanted to come on camera today you girls and talk about these lovely bags as well as my new beautiful one that i went ahead and hunted down and scored and tried to find this bag until eventually i was able to pick her up and add her to my collection remember to like comment and subscribe on my channel stick with me for more videos on michael kors check out my michael kors series and i'll see you girls in tomorrow's video bye